Welcome. I'm Jim Peters and it's my great privilege to be with you and I trust you'll find that something here that's uh, helpful. Today I'd like to say that you're perfect. In the past two chats we spoke about the fact that it's not the end and that you can do all things through Christ um, who strengthens you and that by Jesus stripes you have been healed. But what's this about being perfect? Most people don't feel perfect. You know how far short that you've fallen from the mark, the same as I do. And uh, perhaps like me, you feel that you failed and that God could never use you or never forgive you as I did at one time. Well, here's the good news. In Christ, all your sins are forgiven. Psalm 103, 12 tells you that as far as the east is from the west, so far has he removed your sins from you. In fact, what Father God looks at when he looks at you is perfection. He only sees the perfection of his Son. You're washed in the blood of Jesus and you are white as snow. Philippians 3, 8 to 11 says, Indeed, I count everything as loss because knowing Christ Jesus, my owner and master, is more important. I have lost everything for him and counted all as garbage so that I could get Christ and be found in him not having my own righteousness coming from the law, but having God's righteousness through complete trust in Christ, based only on complete trust, knowing the power of him being raised up from death, sharing in his sufferings, and being made like him in his death, so that I will come to be raised up from death. Basically, you're good. You have the righteousness of Christ. As always, I'd love to give you the opportunity to pray and make Christ your personal Saviour. Just pray with me now. Heavenly Father, forgive me. I change my thinking to your ways. I give complete control of my life to Christ Jesus. And by the power of the Holy Spirit, I ask you to help me to live every day to please you. In Jesus' name, Amen. Thank you so much for joining me. I look forward to seeing you again next time. Bye for now.